cool, crisp autumn night. And welcome to Division I football here on the Northeast Sports Network. And in motion once again, here comes Potter trying to get back around side. He's got some blockers, cuts back down inside, and he gets down inside the 10, tries to cut back around, and he is ridden out of bounds uh, there by number 65. A toss out to the left, and it has gotten to Potter. Touchdown on a five-yard run. It only took a minute and a 25, 35 seconds. Yard pick up that time by Sappho, and rolling back to pass. Out here, it is complete. Getting some running room down the field. Rough and tumble number 80, Darren Callen. Mulligan. That's it. Play for free sometimes. And a nice little bouncing uh, kick received. It is uh, Potter. Got some running room up the far sideline, and nice little saving tackle there. Uh, Potter keep him inside, and that's why they were able to successfully get Claflin up. And now it is Potter trying to get back outside. Cuts back up inside, and finally hit and drop there. Nice job by number 33, Josh. Wait quick to get a couple of yards down through, and that is Claflin going in for the touchdown. And it is on the 11-yard run. Sappho in motion once again, gets it tossed out to the right side. Got Kelsey on the block. Got some running room. Cuts back up inside. Cuts over to the far slide. And a saving tackle there. The other thing. Because we've seen it on the Hartford side already in this football game. 35, 40 yards. Oh, a little kind of a Look at this. Up. Look at this. Oh, an onside kick, and BFA recovers it. You BFA recovers it. Wow. Something going on offense. And a toss out to Sappo. Let's see if we get Kelsey on the block. And the outside, Sappo jumps over his man and touchdown. BFA, I don't see any flags. And no trickery here. If he were closer, Berno gets it on the fly. And a great oh! hit of the block. Oh, my. Berno gets to the outside. Another great hit. Oh, my. I have just seen two of the best blocks I have seen. And it's Claflin going up the middle, and he gets in there, goes to the left side, touchdown on a 13-yard run. And they put it in, and a big play there. The Hurricanes started out, especially in that first quarter, with a short field to work with. Well, they're looking for a pass, toss out here, and it is complete. He hauls it in. And it, you have guessed it, touchdown. BFA, and we have got ourselves a nail biter and a seat squirmer. They're not, they didn't need it. Uh, hand off up the middle, and it is going to be a touchdown for Hartford. Third down and long. Johnson with plenty of time. He's going to air it out. It is intercepted, and that is got there by number six, Taylor Potter. Bringing it back, we get a flag back here. And uh, cut up the middle, and it is touchdown, and uh, that really puts a nail in that coffin of BFAs. Again, goes back to pass, got his man open up the middle, and it's caught after he tipped it. Touchdown, what a pretty touchdown. Side kick action, Sappho gets it. He's looking for, oh, you get a man open in the middle, and it's caught, touch, conversion. Uh, here we go. Oh, oh good boy! Good. Ball's loose. Wow, BFA saying they got it. Oh, my. BFA got the football. Oh, <laughs> Last two minutes. What are they going to call? Jassel was back to pass. Everybody flooding outside. You got one man over here on the near side. It is knocked away. Well, how close was this? 329 yards of offense for the Hurricanes, 322 for the Bob Whites. Wow. And that's just about the difference of the game. And uh, the final score, as you see Hartford go out onto the field to celebrate, they beat the BFA Bob Whites in the 2000.
12 Division I Championship.